Alright guys, we are back and today we are looking at Dagger Mike 2023 Spirit Halloween Dagger Mike animatronic. So majorly cool and awesome. I wasn't sure how much I was actually going to like Dagger Mike when I first saw him on the website. I think I liked him a little bit, but I was like, eh, I'm going to have to see him in the stores. And when I got into the stores and I saw him, I thought he was totally awesome. Dagger Mike is a short little dude with a little dagger in his hand. And he's short, and he's looking down, and you go around the corner, and then you start to hear him, and then he jumps up out of nowhere, scares the crap out of you, and laughs maniacally while he plans your death with his dagger. Or something like that. <laughs> so before we get to opening him up, let's take a look at the box. This is Dagger Mike right here. Look at the look on that guy's face. Spirit Halloween 2023 Dagger Mike. Head tilts upward as his body quickly pops up while he laughs maniacally. Stands 3 feet 11 inches tall and extends up to 4 feet 9 inches tall. The only thing I think is kind of weird about him is how low, like, the crotch of his pants is hanging down. That is very, very strange and reminds me of hip-hop in the 1990s. And if you ask if I ever used to wear my pants like that in the 90s, I'd be lying if I said... No. <laughs> but anyways, this isn't about me. This is about our little pal, Dagger Mike. So let's move this box around here. We got three pictures of Dagger Mike on the side. We have a picture of him talking right here. Head tilts upward as his body quickly pops up and he laughs maniacally. This is a picture of him before he pops up. He has his daggers in his hands and he's looking down. And then this is the picture of him after he jumps up. As we turn him around to the back, you can see that he was one. $69.99 in the stores or online and never forget you can get 20% off if you have a coupon. So there is a story about Dagger Mike right there and where he came from. A little bit of extra information about him and how he works. We continue to turn the box to this side and oh it's the exact same pictures as the other side. <laughs> so let's go ahead and bring him back around here and let's get this guy unboxed and set up I cannot wait to see how he looks in my own little room here in my own house. And as with the other animatronics that we have unboxed recently, you can see that he has a box inside the box that pulls out and makes it very easy to get to all his components. And there's a hand with a dagger in the box. Oh, here's my receipt, actually. I bought this guy in Las Vegas. And yeah, I used the 20% off coupon, so his regular price was $169.99. The coupon gave me $34 off, making him $136.61. So we have his clothes, the instructions. We have a hand with a dagger in it. That actually looks pretty cool right there. We have another hand with a dagger in it right there. And I never noticed before, but the fingers of his gloves are cut off. That reminds me of the 80s. A piece of foam, another piece of foam. We have a shoe. What is that? We have another shoe. What is that? What are those? We have Dagger Mike's head in a bag. Hmm. Kinda looks like me, but that's a story for another day. Let's see, we got a shoulder form, power cord, voice box, and the rest of this is zip tied in there. Oh boy, this is gonna be fun. Part of his frame and his base. That, 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 that. Yeah, I think we're good to go. Okay, so the first thing we need to do is set out the base. Next up are the shoes and they have divots on the bottom, so that tells me I already have the base wrong. <laughs> one there, one there. Next up is this thing. Lay the costume with IR sensor over the middle base. Uh, hat, that thing, this thing, costume. Okay, already I did it wrong. So I have to take this back off. Why do I always have so much trouble with these things? The legs, not the arms, the legs. All right, one there, one there, right? Foot on, foot on. Then we can put it on the base this way. There we go, that is much easier. All right, there we go, okay. <sighs> Attach the shoulder frame to the pop-up mechanism. I guess that's this thing. 
attach the shoulder frame. So this way, ah, but it shows it the other way. Okay, locked into place. Attach the pop-up mechanism with the shoulder frame to the metal frame. All right, let's bring this guy back just a little bit. Attach the leg foams to the assembled body form by inserting the torn end into the shoes. Okay, so here's the torn end. Ah, okay, here we go. Velcro here, Velcro there, torn end into the shoes. All right, there's one. Two, okay. I think that's right. Whew. Attach the blister shoulder form. Secure with zip ties. Place the inside liner with metal loop over the assembled body form. So that's this. How are you supposed to get the stupid arms in there? Oh. I got it. Oh, you animatronics anger me to no extent. <laughs> Attach the clown head to the shoulder part. All right, clown head. Secure with the screw. Thread the metal hook through the shoulder frame. Okay. Hang the control box. All right, we're gonna get our power cord and our step pad ready too. Hang the control box on the pop-up mechanism. What the wire to plug in? I'm gonna plug this in right now too. And the step pad. Hang the control box, blah, blah, blah. Pull up the costume, plug in the sensor. Okay, attach the hands. These hands totally crack me up. Attach the collar and the hat. Collar. Look at this little dunce cap. <laughs> Alright, there's his hat. And I think that's about it. Plug him in and get him going. Alright, here we go. Hold on. <laughs> <laughs> His hat hit the ceiling. All right, I could put him on the ground, but it really doesn't matter to me. Just that when he jumps, his hat, his hat hits the ceiling. All right, let's get him going here. <laughs> <laughs> he is pretty dang cool, guys. Yeah, if I'd set him on the ground, his hat wouldn't get smashed when he jumps up. Let's watch him here a minute. <laughs> his head almost hits the ceiling. <laughs> There we go, it pops right back up. Anyways, there he is, guys. Dagger Mike, he wasn't too hard to put together. All these things seem to have their little quirks and they're kind of a pain in the butt to get together. But once you get them together, they are totally awesome. All right, Mike, I'll see you later. <laughs>